One day, Henny Penny was pecking at corn in the rickyard when an acorn hit her on the head. Goodness me, said Henny Penny. The sky is falling. I must go and tell the king. So she was running across the yard when Cocky Locky saw her and asked, Where are you going, Henny Penny? And Henny Penny said, Oh, I am going to tell the king the sky is falling. May I go with you? asked Cocky Locky. Certainly, said Henny Penny. And they went off together. Soon, in the same yard, they met Ducky Daddles. Where are you going, Henny Penny and Cocky Locky? asked Ducky Daddles. And they said, Oh, we're going to tell the king the sky is falling. May I go with you? asked Ducky Daddles. Certainly, they said. And Henny Penny and Cocky Locky and Ducky Daddles went to tell the king the sky was falling. Sometime later, they came across Goosey Pussy. Where are you going, Henny Penny, Cocky Locky, and Ducky Daddles? asked Goosey Pussy. And they said, Oh, we're going to tell the king the sky is falling. May I go with you? asked Goosey Pussy. Certainly, they said. So Henny Penny, Cocky Locky, Ducky Daddles, and Goosey Pussy went to tell the king the sky was falling. Just as they were leaving the yard, they met Turkey Lurkey. Where are you going, Henny Penny? Cocky Locky, Ducky Daddles, and Goosey Pussy asked Turkey Lurkey. And they said, Oh, we're going to tell the king the sky is falling. May I go with you? asked Turkey Lurkey. Certainly, they said. So they all went together to tell the king the sky was falling. So they went along their way, and soon they were deep in the forest when they met Foxy Woxy. Where are you going? Henny Penny, Cocky Locky, Ducky Daddles, Goosey Pussy, and Turkey Lurkey, asked Foxy Woxy. And they said, oh, we're going to tell the king the sky is falling. Oh, but that is not the way to the king, said Foxy Woxy. I know the right way. Come with me. And Foxy Woxy showed them the entrance to a dark, narrow hole. This was Foxy Woxy's burrow. This is the shortest way, said Foxy Woxy. You go first and I will follow you. Now the fox's plan was to trap them in his burrow and then eat them one by one. But Henny Penny, who went in first, soon discovered it was a dead end and was worried and told Cocky Locky about it. And Cocky Locky started crowing and frightened the rest. So when Foxy Woxy came in, they all jumped on the fox and started pecking him so he was only just managed to run away. When the group of friends got out of the burrow, it was already dark, and Henny Penny suddenly remembered that it was time for her to lay her eggs. So she turned round and bustled off to her nest, and all the rest ran after her, and they never told the king the sky was falling.